of bullying is one seeks to harm, intimidate, or coerce an individual into something. Bully, a bully comes in all shapes and sizes. They can do it softly or they can do it intimidatingly. Alright? Bullying is not just a physical thing. It can be verbal or can even be online. It is not done just at school. It is also done in the community and anywhere you might be at home. An adult can be a bully. Uh-huh. An adult can be a bully. By that I mean when they address a kid and it intimidates the kid, it makes the kid respond in a negative way. So we as adults, when trying to relate to our kids, we have to relate to them so that they understand what we're trying to say and they can receive the message in a positive way. I say again, when we relate information to our kids, we have to relate it to them in a positive way so that they can understand what we're trying to say. And if the adult is making you feel uncomfortable, you should say, excuse me. It appears that when somebody, when a little kid says, excuse me to an adult, the adult kind of snaps too and says, well, hold up, evidently, I, I, I didn't relate the information that I needed to relate. All right? Peer pressure. If you should see somebody being bullied, if you should see somebody being bullied, try to help them. An example, like if somebody's being bullied at school and you should see that, you should maybe go over there and say, hey, you want to sit at my table and eat? Or if y'all playing a game and they're making you do something you don't want to do, come over here, play some basketball with me. Come to karate class with me. <laughs> and uh, if in the event you are bullied people, the first thing you need to do, and repeat, all right, the first thing you need to do if you're being bullied, what do you need to do? Let me hear somebody say that. What is it, sir? What do you need to do? I can't hear you. I still can't hear you. Did everybody get that? Tell your teacher or tell your mom. Let's all say that together. Tell your teacher or tell your mother. I'm a karate instructor, all right? And I don't advocate physical contact. I do not advocate physical contact. But if you don't have your defense, what do you have? Nothing. Let me hear. What do you got? I can't hear you, sir. I cannot hear you. Did everybody get that? If you don't have your defense, what do you have? Nothing. 
All right, you know, there's four basic blocks that I always teach my people. No matter who they are, how old they are, male, female, or whatever, I teach them their four basic blocks. So at this time, I want everybody to put your hands like so. Do it. Don't take all day. All right, it's like a windshield wiper. Outside block, and the inside block. Outside block, inside block. Now on the other side. Outside block, inside block. Outside block, inside block. Okay, now I need one uh, one student to come up here and help me. Outside block, B. And on this side, bam. Outside, bam. Outside, bam. Double outside block. Now, now put one hand on your hip. You got the outside block. You got the inside block. Outside block, inside block. Okay, now, a typical scenario. Some character comes and grabs you like that. Double outside block. Oh, that's on the really test. <laughs> Double outside block. All right, some character comes and try to create physical harm on you. And you grab, bam. Double outside block. Check it out. Ready to go. Uh, if, if you're a bully, what's the first thing you do? Uh, that is correct. Bullets come in all shapes or sizes. Give me uh, three incidents how, uh, how you can be bullied. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And McDonald, that's correct. Are you listening? Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah, see, uh, what, what else you got to say? Yeah, that's right. A repeated incident where they keep on messing with you every day and making you uncomfortable, that is considered bullying. All right, okay. Yes, sir. How you look? You know, you might be short, you might be whatever, and they don't appreciate it. But now, my favorite uh, thing is sticks and stones. Okay, I, you're going to finish this. Sticks and stones can break my bones, but words will never hurt me. Man, I went all the way through. <laughs> yeah, I, I wanted to get You're here for it. Yeah, sticks and stones can break my bones, but what? <laughs> That's right. So they can come to you and they can say, and you can say, all right. Okay, that's all I have. I hope today that you people remember that. And I hope that, okay, I'm going to get my stability together too. I hope something that I said today will help you go forward in life. Remember parents, don't be a bully to your kids. Watch what you say to your kids. You have to, you have to lead by example. If you use profanity, that kid will use profanity. If you get physical in front of them, that kid will be physical. Remember that. What? I don't, all right, I don't that's all that I have. Does anybody else have? Everyone for coming out to celebrate, have fun, from the little ones to the big ones.